cop burst today in a courtroom from the teenager accused of going on a multi-state crime spree with his 13-year-old girlfriend. 18-year-old Dalton Hayes is facing several charges, including rape. WLKY's Christina Mora is live tonight at the Grayson County Courthouse with new details about this case. Christina? Dalton Hayes is going to have to come back here a week from today. He and during that time, the court will be deciding if he's competent to stand trial. His participation in the hearing today was cut short after he had an outburst and left. This is Commonwealth Kentucky versus Dalton Hayes. Deputies escorted 18-year-old Dalton Hayes into the Grayson County courtroom Thursday for what was scheduled as a preliminary hearing. But seconds after sitting down, it was clear Hayes wasn't happy with our camera in the courtroom. You can take back out. Hayes was gone for the rest of the hearing while Judge Goff explained why the proceedings would be pushed back to next week. This counsel had indicated that he was concerned about the, uh, Mr. Hayes' competency. Authorities say Hayes left town with his 13 year old girlfriend, evaded police, and racked up criminal charges for two weeks. While the court decides if Hayes is competent, we're learning more about the days leading up to the alleged multi state crime spree. According to court documents, before authorities say he left town, Hayes was just out on bond for two charges separate from this case, second-degree burglary and theft by unlawful taking. While deputies say Hayes was on the run, he missed the required drug screenings, pretrial meetings, and a court hearing for that case. Now his list of charges has grown to include second-degree rape, custodial interference, burglary, criminal mischief, trespassing, and theft. Now back to this issue of Dalton Hayes and the media. It was late last week that the judge put a gag order on Dalton Hayes, meaning we could not get an in-jail interview with Hayes. And then there was a motion against that by TV host Dr. Phil. Well, officially this week, the judge denied that request. No one will be interviewing Dalton Hayes while he's in jail. His defense counsel says that he gave up incriminating evidence during an interview in Florida by the media. So that will not be happening here in Grayson County for now. That is the latest from the Grayson County Courthouse. Christina Mora, WLKY News.